Hi guys, Postman's Bin. Got a bag here. I've actually worked what it worked out what it is feeling it. Does it tell us anyway? Uh, gift. Okay, I know what it is. It's one of these, or two of these actually, and I'll explain why in a second. Just check that I'm right first. Yep. Okay. So, why have I bought two more? Well, if you watch the video where I put this one together, I used infrared LEDs. I thought I'd be clever and make myself an infrared light bulb. Unfortunately, I plugged it in and it didn't work. And when I checked the LEDs, most of them were dead. Now, I thought it might have been that I'd put that in there and it had made contact with the back of some of these terminals, like that, terminations, and shorted it out that way. But, in the comments on the video, when people have looked at my video, they've said, well, hang on a minute, infrared LED light bulbs, or LEDs, sorry, um, are only about 1.4 volt forward bias, whereas normal white LEDs are about 3 volts. So it could well be that I fried them all straight away because they're getting twice as much voltage as they were expecting. So um, I'm going to make another one, but this time what I will do is change that resistor. At the moment that's brown, black, black, which is 100, 100 ohms. That's what I think. And when BigClive.com did one of these, he changed that out for a bigger resistor. Actually, I'm sure he said the one he had was 10 ohms and he changed it to 100. Either way, I'm going to put a bigger resistor in there to try and drop the voltage a bit more and save all my hard work, because these are dead. So that's what that'll be. I'll do another one of these. And infrared LEDs again. But I'll try it with a different resistor. So that'll be a little project to do.